Well, hi, I'm Cody Sandall, pastor here at the First Presbyterian Church of Littleton, and wanted to give you uh, kind of the, the Holy Week schedule this year and some invitations to participate. Uh, first off, on in the sermon, I mentioned uh, an invitation to, to make a sign, you know, for your, for your house, for your yard, or if you're already out, you know, doing uh, some other essential errand, feel free to bring one to the church lawn or to the church tree, you know, something like that to show you know, if Jesus can walk out of the tomb, he can walk out of our building and into our homes, into our neighborhoods as well. Uh, I have uh, below in this email, I have just a, a handful of ideas uh, for some chalk art or other signs, or you can, you know, hang something uh, from your porch. Um, some, most of the examples say he is risen. I will make one recommendation, which is change it to, to Jesus is risen or Christ is risen. Uh, I think you might be surprised how many people don't know what we're talking about when we say he is risen. It might go, who is risen? Um, so to uh, to be a better witness to our neighbors, let, let's spell out who is risen. Uh, and, and I'd also encourage you to do a little bit more than just Happy Easter. If we're trying to be a witness to Christ walking out of the tomb, let's make sure people know that uh, we're not just celebrating the Easter bunny, but we're celebrating Jesus. So I encourage you to use Jesus or Christ in whatever sign uh, that you make. I think that will be a better witness uh, to our neighbors, to our neighborhoods, and uh, and faithfulness to Christ. Uh, another thing that's coming up is Maundy Thursday. I mentioned this as well in the sermon on Sunday, that we are going to have a live video uh, prayer time uh, for about an hour. The first 45 minutes we'll be uh, praying, and then the last uh, 15 minutes about will be a communion that we will celebrate together uh, over a video meeting. Pastor Carol and I will, will lead that. Um, so it's kind of have, have whatever elements you can find, something close to bread, something close to juice, uh, and, uh, and we will celebrate uh, communion together. Again, I believe that, that through the Holy Spirit, Jesus will be present with us um, even though we're not together in person. And I also attached a link for a training for installing and getting running on Zoom, which is the app we will use uh, for our video meeting. Um, and if you are having some uh, some troubles with that, please let me know or ask someone else you know, uh, and they can uh, try to help you before Thursday. It's going to be Thursday at 11, uh, and for the beginning of the prayer time, 11.45 uh, for, the, uh, for the communion. And again, if you can't join us uh, over Zoom, maybe just uh, celebrate, you know, have some bread and juice on your own at 11.45 and have a prayer time, knowing that you're communing with us in spirit. Um, Good Friday, we decided to add uh, a very short uh, video worship service. Uh, um, Mary and Matthew Daly will uh, have a couple of songs, and then Pastor Carol is having a, a Good Friday sermon. Uh, so we will send that out uh, on, on Friday. And then, of course, our Easter worship service uh, will be posted. We'll be sending it out just like we have been. Some of you have been asking, you know, when can I expect uh, the videos to be live? And um, I am posting the, the, the videos each Sunday before 8 a.m. It's usually a little bit earlier than that, uh, but it's uh, 8 a.m. is when you can expect the, uh, the video worship to be live on Sunday. So those are some of the things that are coming up. Again, I, I hope that you are still on the lookout for ways to be uh, praying for your neighbors. Uh, maybe that's prayer walking. Maybe that's uh, you know, just being you know, talking to your neighbor six feet or more over the fence or something like that, asking how... Uh, how they're doing, um, you know, kind of keep your antenna up for ways to be the hands and feet of Christ safely during this time and uh, looking forward to celebrating uh, Holy Week uh, and all of its ups and downs and celebrating Easter, you know, the core of our faith together. I know even though we are not with each other in body, we are with each other in spirit because we worship a very big God.